It's Esteban, and I'm joined by two men known for making hits. All right, to my right, we got multi-platinum artist Flo Rida, and to his right, we have pro bowler Tamba Ali. What's going on, gentlemen? Oh, man, definitely happy to be up here for Super Bowl, you know, ready to enjoy all the festivities. Now, a lot of people think that there's a lot of similarities between being a pro athlete and being a professional rapper or musician. Do you guys agree? that there are similarities? You know, you have artists, you know, who loves to hit the gym, football players, they, you know, they definitely have to work out. You know, music is just a, 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 a attribute that brings everybody together. I mean, athletes, they get pumped off of music, as well as, you know, artists as well. So, I mean, it's, it's a lot of similarities like that. As a football player, we compete in uh, listening to music. It helps us, you know, get ready to go out there and uh, compete. There's been athletes who have tried their hand in the music arena some better than others. Do you know of anyone in the league right now who you think could like really make a transition as a singer or an MC? Yeah, I mean, myself. Oh, what? <laughs> I was gonna say that. <laughs> That's what's up. Um, now you're talking about getting behind the mic or as, <laughs> as a label head? Getting behind the mic, I could do. That's what I love doing as an artist. Uh, but what I, I should do and what I will do is be as a label head, um, you know, give give opportunity to guys who or and girls who are coming up and want to do this as a full time job. Uh, you know, not to discredit the artists, they do take a lot of time into their craft. I mean, and on that note, let's talk about the label you started. How did you know? How, how did you decide you wanted to start? taking a hand in the music industry and helping to bring out some new artists. So basically giving you know opportunity to other people to be able to get in the, the industry is what I chose to do and uh, starting with Gilly the Kid and uh, I have a, a guy named uh, Stars right now who's who's in the pop lane. That, that, that was my point of view of starting a label and, and hopefully being able to do some records myself to display that I can I can do music. You could definitely scratch that itch by jumping on your own artist records. Yeah, I could that do the works. P. Diddy. I could do the there P. Diddy, the, the bird, man. Yeah, I could definitely do that. So we always ask athletes what they're listening to when they're training, but what are you listening to when you're in training? Like, I'm always telling my nephews, like, they're always working out with their headphones and things like that. Myself, I really don't uh, thrive on listening to music, you know, when it comes to working out. But fortunately, if I'm in the gym, a lot of times I have my music playing. Right. You know, they're in there with the, uh, doing that, the uh, treadmill and everything like that, and people are listening to my music. So, I mean, I guess it gets some people motivated, but myself, you know, um, from day one, I always was the type of person who probably work out 3 o'clock in the morning, you know, on the balcony and without music. Tamba, Flo, thanks so much for dropping by. Super Bowl 48 weekend, man. Enjoy your festivity. Oh, appreciate it. A pleasure. Thank you.